hundreds of Pacific Beach residents showed up to tonight's protest, saying this 23-story development will forever change the character of their coastal community, and they are ready to fight. This is day one of this fight. Raising signs and showing their strength in numbers, these PB residents are passionately opposed to the possibility of a 238-foot high-rise in their community, proposed for turquoise and cast streets. Um, I can't say it on television. Lifelong resident Ann Texas says this project, with its 213 residential units and more than 300 parking spaces, makes no sense in this area. I think we should have more of a say in it, and I understand the developers and all the money they're putting into this, but it is just not right. But whether the community or city council will have a say in this project is uncertain. The developer, Colonymous, is using a state law that allows it to bypass the current 30-foot height limit in this coastal area, a restriction that San Diegans voted for in 1972. Now that's being ignored by Sacramento. Your vote means nothing. For its part, the developer says that the goal is to make this beach community accessible to a lot more San Diegans who otherwise wouldn't have the ability to live here. We're talking about making hundreds of units available in a desirable community where the barrier to entry has been historically very high. PB resident Ryan Stock, who serves on the PB planning group, is in favor of the project. My generation is struggling to buy housing, and when the baby boom went happened, we had a giant construction Boom, and we built supply for them, so why not for us? But he was in the minority in this crowd Wednesday night. Catherine Douglas of the Coastal Coalition says mammoth projects like this and the ensuing traffic would block San Diegans access to this coastal destination. Our roads can't handle what they've got now in Pacific Beach. What do you think if you add another thousand people to it? In a letter to the PB planning group, Mayor Todd Gloria and council member Joe LaCava, who did not attend the protest, says they're a opposed to the project, but these residents are demanding more action from their representatives. So we all need to fight together on this. It is not just a coastal issue. Richard Allen, CBS 8.